Hello Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, welcome. And welcome cross watchers. I'm going to be taking a look at what is going on for you guys in your situation with you and the person that is on your mind. Whenever you come across this reading will be the right time for you to see it. Um, but as always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. If by the end of this reading you're still needing some more messages or confirmation, you can always take a look at your other placements. That's always an option for you. And if you are interested in personal readings, that information will always be left in the description box below. Okay, let's see Libra. What's been going on here? What's been happening for my Libras? Libra Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Okay. I'm seeing somebody ran away. Somebody was a runner. A runner in a codependent relationship. Fear of intimacy. Listening to the ego. So somebody ran based on fears of um, getting close. Fears of opening up, listening to ego and pride. I'm seeing that you've lost hope when it comes to somebody changing. Um, star reversed. It's like you've lost your patience with someone. And you, I, I, I really see that this is something that has brought up a lot of fears um, because at one point you were very hopeful, but somebody broke their promise or somebody just wasn't um, committing to their word. Their word didn't, didn't follow through. Something just wasn't followed through. So somebody ran away here. Somebody was, um, somebody was trying to get away from the situation. I'm hearing somebody is away. You're away, Libra. It's like you're away for the moment. You could be dealing with somebody from the past, Six of Cups, or a situation from the past that has, that somebody hasn't changed from. Something from the past that hasn't really changed for some of you. But I, I, I do see that there's a sense of You've made some sort of forgiveness. I feel like you've come to peace with things, but at the same time, you're not you're not as hopeful as you once were. Like you're not you just like don't care anymore for some of you. Um Six of Swords, you you've been trying to navigate this situation and you're almost being carried to a whole new destination here, willingly or unwillingly. I feel like your guides are kind of pushing you towards um a calmer place here so you really don't know what's on the opposite side of this you don't know what's where things are headed um, for some of you there's some sort of regrets that you may have here um, right before the six of swords we have the five of swords which is something that has really opened up your eyes um, after being blindfolded but I'm seeing that you're being carried towards a new destination here um, so let's take a look at you now, Libra. We have abundance. So I feel like I'm very connecting. I'm connecting to a Libra who is attracting a lot of abundance for themselves. I think last week I, I got the same card in the same position. So that's really crazy. This is just double confirmation here. So um, you may want to check out last week's Libra reading as well, but we have abundance. Keep a positive mindset. Manifest exactly what you want. Gratitude and bliss. So you're in your bag right now or you're attracting a lot of everything, like a lot of love, a lot of um, abundance, prosperity, wealth in every area of your life, health as well. So let's take a look at you right now Libra what's been going on here five of swords reversed you've come to peace with something and you've taken a risk here um, with this fool card to a new start 
you you're it's like you don't know what's to come from this new beginning you don't know what risk you're taking by taking that next step here but you're doing it anyways um you're leaving the conflict behind five of swords reverse it's still on the back of your mind but it's not bothering you like how it once did so the full card is you taking this chance towards a whole new beginning not really being able to see where things are going um but you're following your faith and your intuition as well. So you're going towards something beautiful with the amount of knowledge that you have already. So the lessons and everything that you have learned up until this point is taking you towards this new destination. You're so close. You just have to take that little leap there. So I do see that you're taking this, this new leap for yourself and you are being more free like you're freeing yourself from this conflict you're freeing yourself from the anxiety and you're taking your power back king of wands you're you're taking back your power and you're taking this this new start in confidence here so i see you taking up this king of wands energy where you're going after what it is you that you want and you're you're making things happen you're taking that risk also, the King of Wands, this is somebody who's very, very powerful and abundant. So I do see you tapping into this, this abundance energy. And on top of that, you have a bunch of opportunities for you. Seven of Cups, you have options, Libra. And there's going to be a bunch of uh, choices that are going to be given to you, um, especially in love. You have options in love. But I do see that you're going to be pulled in many different directions here about what to choose. Um, you're confused about it, but you're going for it anyways. I see you freeing yourself. I, I see you being um, in this position of just going with the flow of things not taking things too seriously now or not even taking um, love that seriously but at the same time you're going to be presented with a bunch of options for you so let's take a look at the person that's on your mind if you don't have anyone on your mind this can just be somebody who is around your energy so let's take a look here queen of cups could be a pisces a cancer or a Scorpio here so I do see that this person is feeling a little bit emotional right now they are this person does really care about you Libra Queen of Cups and they they do have their eyes on you we have sunglasses in their energy so watching looking stalking gaslighting perception focusing out I, I do see that this person is releasing themselves from some sort of attachment that has had them because of love because of their love for you or because of love in general they're releasing um something that was toxic in their life here the devil reversed they're getting out of it and they're releasing what was um what was bad for them what wasn't allowing this person to to be the 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 most mature best version of themselves here so i'm seeing that um they're not really communicating right now or there's not much communicating but they're they're releasing uh something toxic in their life here it's coming full circle with the world card um i see a chapter is ending in their life where they have it has not been easy it has been a struggle and they've had some sort of addiction that they have um that they are currently getting over here but two of swords they, they're at a crossroads as well they're at a crossroads when it comes to a decision on a partnership they don't really know what to do their eyes are blindfolded as you can see so they're they're trying to just follow their intuition here their instincts but this is why you're not really hearing from them also this could be somebody who lives at a distance from you um but i i do see that this person is uh, something something tra something about travel was delayed or canceled uh, but right now they're kind of at a crossroads here this this person thinks the world of you libra um and they're but they're needing to release something from their life so let's take a look at the near future for you libra what could happen in the near future for my libras
Okay, we have date. Meeting someone new, dating, get back out there, planner set a date here. So, ooh, we have a pair, Queen of Cups and King of Cups. So this is a, like a divine counterpart here. I do see that there is new energy. Meeting someone new, dating, get back out there, planner set a date. I'm seeing that um, in the next few weeks here, there I see messages coming in, but honestly, I still see that there's not a lot of it. Um, somebody isn't feeling totally um, secure. I'm seeing financially here in the next few weeks. Um, page of disc reverse, nine of disc reverse is like, there's an opportunity here, an offer, but it's, I'm seeing that it's, it's, it's slow or it's being slow right now. Somebody isn't feeling fulfilled because some sort of message isn't going through here or some sort of offer isn't, isn't going through. So, um, uh, somebody is, is holding back. I'm seeing you holding back Libra, especially on your communication, um, there's something there for some of you when it comes to um, dating. But I don't really... See, I see somebody wanting to date or wanting to meet up and then it just being like cancelled last minute. Or it just doesn't follow through. Let's take a look at the outcome for you. Ooh, Ace of Wands. Wow. Wow. In the outcome, Libra, we have the sword and the rose. So that's clarity and that's truth. A revelation is coming towards you. Solidarity, force, honor, protection, power. I'm hearing integrity. You're taking, um, there's a new start here for you. So this is a whole new beginning. I feel like this is um, someone new that you're starting to, um, there's some sort of spark there. You're taking action towards your happiness. Nine of cups. So I do feel like you're, um, I do see some sort of wish fulfillment that is taking action or it's going to start to take action maybe a year from now um, or nine months from now. But this is going to make you really happy. You're going to be very satisfied. Like I see you doing self-care as well, but there is some sort of clarity that you're getting um, about a new start. And I see you putting an end to some drama and conflict and, and not seeing eye to eye with each other. Ace of Discs, wow. We have two aces here for you. So this is double confirmation. You have a golden opportunity here, a new brand new beginning. I'm seeing a commitment here for you guys. There's going to be passion and there's going to be a commitment. So this is very, there's a lot of potential here for you, Libra. And I do feel like this is with someone new. So there is new love for you. And it does feel like it is a wish fulfillment. Nine of Cups. This is your wish come true. Manifesting. Ace of Disc. A new stream of income. Um, abundance. It's not going to happen in the next few weeks. But I see it happening n nine months from now or a year from now. It's either um, you have money an, a money opportunity coming in for you or another stream of income on the side here that you're taking action from some sort of idea. Some sort of idea that is coming in for you guys that is that you're going to love you're going to love it nine of cups it's, you're going to be very satisfied and very happy with the way that things are going to be a year from now and it's because something is shifting within you some sort of perspective is is changing here i'm seeing that when it comes to you're getting clarity on some sort of like relationship um around you or a partnership that is that I'm seeing is it's you're 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 either withdrawing from or growing apart from but you're going you're moving closer to this new start here with um, brand new energy so let's get some specifics for you Libra
Okay, this person right now is watching you, wondering if you're dating other people. This, there's someone who, in your energy, or the person on your mind is wanting to date you. It, it, this person is wanting to give to you, but they're releasing something right now. Right now, Libra, um, I do see that things are pretty much... Um, open or you're not that serious right now you're not really looking for anything serious at this point um things are kind of up in the air or there's no title or you're just not serious because you're focused on you're focused on your self-love and your abundance but i do see that there is possibly children involved children or somebody who has a child fair male, you or this person or somebody who's fair for their cultural background. Um, at the bottom of the deck, we have family. So I do feel like you are getting closer towards someone who you're meant to be with for the long term, having a family together. But there's something that had to end that wasn't meant to last short term. In order for you to know what you want and what you don't want moving forward, you or this person could be a young male um, or somebody who's um, young at heart. We also have gossip. So there could have been gossip or I'm seeing that mostly there's just a lot of different opinions that could be confusing you that you're not really sure about. But ultimately, um, I see that in your in nine months or a year from now, there is new love, mostly for the fact that, as you see, you're not really looking for something right now. But with that being said, this is what I'm seeing for you, Libra. If it resonated, let me know in the comment section down below. And if you found guidance or clarity, also let me know if you made it this far in the video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.